What's up guys and welcome back to another video. Well, if you're a New Zealand fan, you are definitely getting excited because rugby is on the verge of returning in less than two weeks away. There's also a strong possibility that we could have see fans in the stadium if New Zealand go on level one lockdown on the 10th of June. So yeah, 10th of June. So all things positive. But the biggest news in today's topic is that Daniel Carter could be set to return to the Super Rugby Championship in New Zealand and what a time it's going to be. But we all think oh, he'll go to the Crusaders. It's his old former home team. Not quite. There's rumour has it that he might be joining the Blues. So Daniel Carter, Bowden Barrett in one team. What a team the Blues are going to have. Now according to the reports is that there's um, Stephen Perfetta has got a foot injury um, that he received in uh, training this past week but now rumor has it because Daniel Carter is a free agent they're looking at they're in talks with him to maybe bring him into the Auckland Blues and what a boost that will be the Blues have been in pretty good form um, we, we saw them have a good super rugby season at the start of the year it was really strong performances from them and they will want to continue that they will want to add an extra boost and what a boost it will be if they can get Dan Carter into the squad now Dan Carter finished up in Japan obviously when rugby and Japan was declared stopped and all that stuff and the league was stopped so he then left Japan because it was his final season then the rumor has it was that he was going to go to the states in order to play uh, in the rugby league there which still is a strong possibility maybe for next year but now because new rugby is back in new zealand and we've got super rugby starting off in less than two weeks time um there is talks that he will be joining the blues as a, a replacement for Stephen, who is now injured on a foot injury so it's definitely exciting um, it should be awesome the blues are taking on the hurricanes at eden park on june the 14th so it should be a cracking game to witness whether we'll see dan dan carter just yet we will have to wait and see but um, what a boost that will bring and what a, a little bit of a good headache for um, the coach of the Blues to, to, to have because where do you put uh, Bowden Barrett? There's so much talk of that they want, they, that they should focus him in um, as fly half and not as full back and, and get him cemented in because you've got Damon, Damian McKenzie returning back, you've got Jordy Barrett, you've got a hell of a lot of competition in that full back margin of talented players that are known for those positions. So you'll want to keep that going. So the focus will be Bowden at um, number 10. But now you've got Daniel Carter, who is the known as one of the greatest ever fly-offs in world rugby. So do you move Barrett back to fullback? Or do you put Carter at centre? Or do you put Barrett at centre? How he's going to work that, we'll have to wait and see. That's obviously if Dan Carter has actually accepted this. But um, it's definitely exciting news. It's fantastic news, I think, for New Zealand fans. Um, Dan Carter, 38-year-old, who, who was in absolute fine form in Japan during the recent um, uh, season. So I think what a motivation in order for New Zealand to kickstart bringing the king of rugby back. And... Um, I mean, he's a dual World Cup winner. Um, obviously, 2015 was his highlighted one because he didn't get injured. Um, Three-time World Rugby Player of the Year. And um, yeah, what, a, what an opportunity. Let's wait and see. Dan Carter, what a player. What a, what a, what a gem of a quality um, star in New Zealand rugby. And um, it's going to be exciting to see what he brings to the Blues. Um, and by the way, if you've watched me for a while, I stated not too long ago that the Blues were my team. So I'm not supporting them just because of Dan Carter. Um, we now I've got a good reason to support the Blues. So let's go. It's going to be awesome. So that's going to do it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Do you think big old Dan is coming back to New Zealand to play for the blues one thing's for sure it is gonna be awesome thanks so much for watching guys stay safe and never give up cheers